बता दें केरल उच्च न्यायालय ने विवादास्पद फिल्म द केरल स्टोरी के प्रदर्शन पर रोक लगाने से इनकार कर दिया है जस्टिस एन नागरेश और सीपी मोहम्मद नियास ने मामले को पांच मई तक के लिए स्थगित कर दिया है आपको बता दें कि याचिका में फिल्म के प्रदर्शन को रोकने की मांग करते हुए कहा गया था कि कथित गलत दिखाया गया है फिल्म के कुछ सीन्स को हटा दिया जाना चाहिए सहयोगी विवेक इस वक्त फोन लाइन पर जुड़ चुके हैं विवेक तो केरला हाई कोर्ट ने रिफ्यूज कर दिया है स्टे देने आ, स्क्रीनिंग पर स्टे देने के लिए आखिर क्या कुछ कहा है हाई कोर्ट ने यस द केरला हाई कोर्ट रिफ्यूज टू स्टे द स्क्रीनिंग ऑफ द कॉन्ट्रोवर्शियल मूवी Kerala story now the division bench of justice uh, n nagresh and cp mohammad nepal uh, has posted the case uh, for may 5th now the one of the observation that has been made uh, by uh, the kerala high court is that uh, this is a movie which has already been uh, you know the, the necessary parts that needs to be censored has already been done 10 cuts has already been done uh, and uh, and some of these are you know related to certain contentious issues of uh, you know naming certain politicians certain political parties and also certain terms uh, which directly uh, you know connect to a community so these parts have been removed and uh, also said that uh, you know uh, you know raising more protest and discussing this issue in the media will only give more publicity to the movie and hence uh, you know the kerala high court has currently uh decided uh, not to intervene as far as the petition is concerned which means that the there is no more hurdles as far as the release of the movie is concerned on the 5th of may remember the supreme court has also intervened in this issue and has made very uh, important comments and uh, they also uh, did not stay uh, uh, you know the peti- uh, stay as far as the petitioner was concerned he was asking for a stay as far as the release is concerned now this clearly shows that uh, you know the movie is all uh, ready to go to be released on the 5th of may